Hi Dresser Cuties, Winnie here. Today we're going to draw a cute bear from Squishmallows. So let's get started. To draw this cute bear, let's first start by drawing this Squishmallow shape. So I'm going to come right here and draw a big curve at the top. So it's kind of like my usual dumpling shape, but just a little bit uh, longer, taller, right? So I'm just going to come up right here and just draw this big curve at the top. So the top is always a little bit narrower. Try to smooth out my curve here. Okay, so then we have this big curve. Let's bring this down. And it's all up to you how tall you want to make your squishmallow. So don't worry about it. Just want to have this dumpling shape, but just a little bit longer, taller. Okay, so I'm just going to go back and forth, take a look and come back in about right here, create my Squishmallow. So then about right there, I'm just gonna go ahead and go in. So this is a very general shape, right? Very, nothing fancy that's popping out from this bear. So we're just gonna start with the body first. So about right here, I'm gonna go ahead and connect it at the bottom with a shallower curve. Okay, finally done, nice and big, right? So then from there, let's go ahead and come towards the center area, but a little bit higher. So say about right here, and I'm going to draw an oval. So this is where the nose and mouth is going to be. So I'm just gonna draw this big oval right by here in the center, and I'm gonna bring it down. And connect. Now that we have that shape in, let's come inside right here towards the top and then I'm just gonna draw a big curve for the nose. We're gonna round it off, give our bear a big nose. Then come towards the center, let's connect it with a V. And then now that we have that, let's come back to the top and we're going to draw a big oval right here for a highlight and shade everything else in. Big bear nose. And then from there, we're going to come right to the center, draw a straight line down, and then we're going to curve up on both sides and cap it off. And there. Okay, so then from there, let's go ahead and to the sides right here, we're going to draw a big circle for the eyes. About right here. Just going to go ahead and draw a circle. And same thing on the other side. So about right here. If you're more comfortable drawing the eyes first and then drawing the center part, you can definitely do that as well. So it's all up to you, whatever is easiest. Okay, so then my two eyes in, I'm gonna come in here and make them draw so cute eyes. Sorry, just make it a little bit bigger. Okay, so then from there, let's draw two small circles inside for highlights. Some nice things about the draw so cute eyes, it's easy to fix, right? <laughs> and we're gonna shade in this part right here at the top. And lines at the bottom. And same thing over here. There. So then the eyes in, let's come to the top of each eye. Well, right here, we're just gonna draw a soft curve. And then now to make it look even more like a bear, because this could really be anything, right? Let's come over here at the top, and about here, we're just gonna add these big round bear ears. And come in. And then let's draw the inside. And let's draw the same thing on the other side. About right here. 
then here. So once again, nice big brown bear ears. And the inside. Okay, so then now that we have that, let's go ahead and draw the tummy area. So about right here, I'm gonna go ahead, give myself another point so I know where I'm going. So about right here, I'm gonna go ahead and draw a big round curve. So I'm gonna go up and to about right there. Right underneath the mouth, and then we're gonna come right back down. So we have our tummy for our bear. And that is pretty much it, except I'm gonna add a heart right here on the side to make it my draw so cute, uh, Bear from Squishmallows. I really hope I helped you draw this cute bear, uh, fun and easy today. And if I did, please make sure to give me a like and subscribe so you won't miss any new Draw So Cute videos. See you later.